These magnets are strong. They hold them in. Gosh, I can take this and go upside down. Nothing's happening. Welcome back to Car Spec Garage. This is what we're working on today. I've had this I, I organizer thing where you kind of push down and it holds the, the shape, but the, it's starting to lose the shape a little bit. You shut the door, you bring it back up. You got things falling everywhere. Just it, things are out of place. And I was really tired of it. And then I came across ulsatools.com. They are a sponsor of this video and we've got two different um, organizers they're three row socket organizers magnetic socket organizers from ulsatools.com and here's their information this box here is a three pack for the metric and then ace sae another three pack um, in red so now these are probably not enough to do all of this but we're gonna we're gonna put a dent in it today and see how well it works we're gonna start on the metric side metric side in my case is right here so we're gonna get those done real quick we'll come back I'll get them put in I'll show it to you again I don't think I have enough to do all of them but this is gonna be the start so let's get efficient let's get our house in order before we start working on this um, the 67 Julia Sprint GT and let's go from there all right guys I've got the metrics set in place of course I do have stuff that I just extra spots that I don't have the sockets for so so, you know, it is what it is on there, uh, which is awesome because now I get to see what I want to add. So basically, I've taken this row, this row, this row. There are some extra ones. Um, this is a 21, if you can see. Um, I don't have the space for the 21. I mean, this one only goes up 20 here. So there'll be some things I'll have to look around and see what to do with those. So there's a few other ones. And then I've got, um, that's a 30 and this is is a probably a 32 so i've got those um and then there'll be some over here on the sae which we're about to get to uh, but man i tell you what this is pretty awesome so this is cool here right so we'll take this over here and i'll all right we'll take it over here and look at that so basically they're sitting in here i can work here work on the car whatever well, of course it'll be down here working on the car and i've got just an awesome place for that to be stored while i'm working again we're trying to make things more efficient in car spec garage or in Paul's garage. Again, you only see most of the competitors only have a two row. These are three row and boy, they're heavy, especially with the tools in them. And I said, not too heavy, but they're heavy enough to where you know these things are, that these things are going to last. And again, I can sit there and say, oh, here's a 19 or oh, here's a 20. So see how much easier that is than coming here and rolling them and trying to figure out what they are. So I am definitely pumped. All right, guys, SAE is done. Again, I've got things I'm missing and we'll figure out how to get those. I've got another set of tools, some Craftsman stuff I'll probably add in here. These are Husky sockets and stuff. Again, perfect for me working on my DIY stuff projects, right? Um, again, we're making a, building a foundation for efficiency inside Car Spec Garage's uh, shop. So here's all my SAEs. I've got those down. Again, we're missing some stuff. I mean, these magnets are strong. They hold them in. I mean, I can't Gosh, I can take this and go upside down, jiggle, nothing's happening. I guess if you jiggle hard enough, something's gonna fall out, some of these really smaller ones. But there we go, so this is all that's kinda left, but this is kinda where we're at. I'm gonna get with the Ulsa about figuring out something to lay in here to get these down. That way we have everything nice and neat. But I tell you what, I really like it better. I know that everybody's probably gonna say, hey, this is laid out better. And the way I had it, yes, cause that's the sockets that I had. And so it laid out perfect, cause I did it. But the cool thing about this is I can just at a glance say, oh, here's a 916. Here's a one and one eighth. You know, it's here's a three three quarter. Here's a thirteen sixteenth. A seven. Here's a 18. So they're all here and no dri no jiggling. This is perfect. So now it's got to, as OCD as I am, I've got to fill this up. I'm going to say that this is great. This literally gives me a better view, bird's eye view, looking down at what I have in my case for all my sockets. And again, I'll fill all these sockets in. So there you have it. So we open it up and there you go. There's all my tools that I've got, sockets, I mean. So this looks a lot better. We'll figure out the rest of it here just in a few minutes. All right, guys, there you have it. Ulsatools.com.